attention. I've been doing this woman right here for 17 years. Our first date was right here. I love her to death. I just want to ask her, will you marry me? What's going on, everybody? Thank you for tuning in. Okay, here we go. My sisters and to my brothers who tune in. But this is what I have spoken about. And this is why I don't. Well, let me just get to the story. Instead of, because it's this, this story is not about me. But this story is about a, a couple who went out April 1st, which was April Fool's. He took his. wifey or girl out after 17 years I consider that you might as well say you are married you just don't have papers but this brother takes his girl out and right in front of the restaurant he get everyone attention and then he gets on his knee and propose to his girl and say 17 years we've been together now I'm asking you, will you marry me? And she breaks down and get emotional. And then this brother stands up and say, April Fools. So apparently he had a ring and cause she seen something. But the actor fact the, how she felt when she walked off if my man get any sex anytime soon it's unbelievable because to propose knowing that a woman takes that serious in 17 years y'all was together y'all probably raised kids together y'all probably you know what I mean doing everything together probably file tax together but Shouldn't her last name have yours? Shouldn't those kids' last name have yours? If you do have children, 17 years. That's a long time. And for men who would probably have taken that beautiful sister a long time ago in marriage, this brother and wasted 17 years of her life. And to play this kind of stunt and say April Fool's Day, that's not something you take lightly. This is part of the reason why a lot of people do not want to get married. Why get married when I can have my cake and eat it too? And I said before that a lot of single women are getting the, the wifey treatment. They are getting treated like married women who carry a man's last name. Make it make sense. But this is how it is. I'm not a man to say, if you fall in love with a woman, you fall in love with a woman. But if you going to be in a serious relationship like that, why not put a ring on her finger? Damn, you can buy her a necklace, you can buy her earrings, but you can't put a commitment ring on that woman's finger. If a woman is not married to you, legally she don't have to claim you. You you have no no claim. You're just girlfriend, boyfriend, you're nothing of importance to that female. And a sad thing, ladies, for you to be in these long relationships with men and not have and knowing at the end you're not going to get no insurance off its insurance policy. Um, you don't get no benefits. Nothing but some good Peter Peak. And, and that's probably it. But you're not going to get. What you deserve in the in the end of uh, uh, of your um 
relationship. You you just wasted time. So if he die, what are he gonna leave you with? What are he gonna leave you with? And then you wait to meet a new man and expect him to give you the world. It's deep. But let's get into this, y'all. Thank y'all for tuning in. I say, man, that this was an out cold way, and I would not have done a sister like this. Thank y'all for tuning in. I'll see you on the next one, y'all. Well, G, peace. I've been this woman right here for 17 years. Our first date was right here. I love her to death. I just want to ask her, will you marry me?